Hi guys, today I've got a tutorial for you on how to put Jelly Bean onto your Samsung Galaxy Ace. This is a custom ROM called Jelly, Bar Jelly Blast V3 and it only works on the Galaxy Ace S5830i so don't try and flash it on the 5830 or you will brick your phone. To start with, there's three files you need to download. There's a kernel, a modules file and the actual ROM. I'll put a link to them in the description. Once you've downloaded them, just put them onto the root directory of your SD card and then make sure your device is rooted, otherwise you won't be able to flash the ROM. Start by putting your phone into recovery mode by pushing volume up, the home button and the power button all at the same time. Just keep holding them. Once it's into recovery mode, you need to make sure you go to wipe data slash factory reset. Then wipe cache partition. Just use your volume buttons to go through the menus and the home button to select. So wipe cache partition. Then apply update from SD card. And then you need to flash the kernel file which is e3 boot it, boot dot image flash that just wait for that to finish install from SD card complete then apply update from SD card again then select the jelly blast ROM that is a zip file as well so just use the home button select that wait for that to install And just leave it for a few minutes so it can install. And also make sure you have at least 50% battery before you start flashing. Otherwise your phone could die halfway and then you'll end up bricking it. Nearly done. And if you get stuck anywhere in this tutorial, um, go to the links in the description and there's loads of help you can find there on the XDA developers website, which is where this ROM was featured. And there you go, that's finished, just wait for that blue bar to go across and there we go, done. Install from SD card complete. After you've done that, go to apply update from SD card again, and then this time you need to select the modules file. After that's done, wipe data slash factory reset. And it's important you do this this reset and this cache partition clear, otherwise your phone will get stuck in a boot loop. After that's done, reboot system now and it should boot into Jelly Bean. Again, I'll put links to where you can download the ROM and the kernel file in the description and go to the go to the link to download the ROM file and you can find all the help you'll ever need there. I've tried this ROM before and it's it's very stable. There I haven't found any bugs whatsoever. But the only problem I found is that the notification bar looks a bit messy, but if you go to the XJ developers link, you'll find lots of help there and there's a 
zip file you can download to flash which helps tidy up the status bar just wait for this to boot up and then we'll be into Jelly Bean Samsung only really took this up to Gingerbread which is 2.3 and this ROM takes you up to Jelly Bean 4.1.1 there are lots of other ROMs you can try, but this one is Jelly Bean and it's new and everybody loves new stuff. Just let that finish booting up and that's it for today uh, please like favorite and subscribe if you found this tutorial helpful and drop a comment of what you would like to see in future videos thank you